Okay guys, I have the handbags box again. This one is from Pennsylvania. I wanted to buy this on when they had the uh, 4th of July sale, but they didn't have any available, so I got it like a few days after. Shipping was $9.99. Tax, what? This is not handbags. This is not handbags. <laughs> this is shoes. I ordered a shoes box. When did I? That's hilarious. I almost said that I didn't know which box this was, but I was like, no, I only have one box coming. It's the handbags box. <laughs> it's shoes. Okay. I ordered this one on the 4th of July. All right. Let me pull up different numbers. <laughs> I was like, that's a weird looking purse. Oh, another purse. All right. Do I restart the video? No, we're just gonna, we're just gonna go with it. Okay. So this is shoes. The subtotal was $60. They had the 4th of July sale <laughs> um, that saved me $20. Shipping was $9.99, tax was $4.90. My total was $70.49. $4.99 per pair of shoes. That seems like more than it normally is. So maybe I'm used to the 30% off sale. And I think it was 25 cents, or 25, 25% off. I was so excited for handbags. Totally forgot about this. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Uh, let me find some matching ones. So um, I am not a shoes expert. Um, yeah. I'll leave it at that. So we have new tags, free waters, size 12, supporting clean water, like lightweight mm, slip on sneakers. They are brand new. I don't know this brand at all. I'm not seeing a price, but here's the tag. I'll try to throw some comps up, but they look nice. All right, we have Lulu's. I have no experience with Lulu's shoes. I know their clothing does pretty well. Um, hopefully I can find the strap. There's a strap missing here. So Lulu's little black heels with maybe just one ankle strap hopefully we can find the other this is nice it has like a super cushioned footbed right here um they're size six the bottoms look pretty good just a little bit of wear but it doesn't really matter if i can't find the ankle strap so we'll set those off to the side chelsea paris not familiar with that. There's some very chunky, clunky, if that wakes the baby up. Oh, I think we're good. He's right above me sleeping. This was a dumb place to film. So strappy heels. Looks like it has some stuff that could just be um, like cleaned off easily. I hate cleaning shoes, but I don't think that would take a lot. Bottoms have somewhere. Um, very unfamiliar with this. Made in Portugal. Size 39. Um, these are Vans. Men's um, high top Vans. They appear to be in pretty good condition. Look at the bottoms. All right. Lace up. Size 11 and a half men's. Okay. J. Crew. Here's, yeah, Jacob. Um, these are kind of cool. And I think that says seven, maybe a size seven. So we have some braided, I don't know what you'd call that, but it's almost like straw. These are really cool. And like, almost like a burlap. I don't know how else to describe that. Bottoms have a little wear. It's coming apart just a little bit here, but I'm not too concerned about that. I like those. Got some boots, Aldo, Aldo. Um, I always try to show you the bottoms first, like always. So what would you call these? Like ankle boots, high top boots or something. Um, here's the bottoms, really good condition. Oh my gosh, don't be my size, please. I don't know how well this brand does. I, I think I've sold it before. I at least have some things listed in my closet. I'll 
try to look later, but these might not have a size. Um, they kind of, they, they look like my size actually. So like an eight and a half, nine. I'll try them on, but I really like those. The last thing I need is boots. Um, mm, I don't know how to say this. Cre Maybe Crevo? Cre mm, I don't know. Um, yeah, I thought these were leather. So, leather boot, brick red, leather upper, size 7. Nice, they do have some wear here in the front, quite a bit actually. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, yeah, quite a bit of wear here, but I mean, it's leather, a little wear in the back. They still have a lot of life left in them and some people really like the weathered look i actually really like the weathered look so i would wear them um maltese that rings a small bell made in italy size seven and a half um little sandal <laughs> also we are missing an ankle strap on this one so hopefully it's in here ah oh, dang I thought I just saw something, but it's not what I thought it was. Okay, so this is what they look like though. Very cute. Leather upper. Here's the bottoms, look fantastic. These feel like really great quality, but we gotta find that strap. Oh no. We have soda. I think this is a pretty cheap brand maybe. I, I think. <laughs> Not real knowledgeable with shoes. Um, here's the bot. Why am I showing you the bottoms? Okay, here's what they look like. So, definitely have some wear. Little heels. Here's the bottoms. They're size six. We have the full ankle strap. And there is some wear, like slashes right there. Um, they don't look too bad in the wrong. We have some Nike high tops. I think this is eight, size eight. They're black, white, just a little bit of wear. Bottoms aren't too bad. I don't really like selling men's, but I totally will. Oh, I see at least one ankle strap. Thank you, Lord. Donald J. Kleiner? These are my size, though. Uh, I don't think I would, these seem pretty high for me. Yeah, no, I'm not wearing this. <laughs> um, so here's the brand, not familiar with that. They're very cute. Heels, open-toed, velvety. The bottoms are very nice. These feel like great quality. Made in Spain, size eight and a half. They're the Jenna style. I'm assuming real leather. Those are super nice. I feel like this is more than 15. I'll add them up when we're done. Oh my gosh, G Geo Geolex? I don't know what this says. Italian patent. These are in really great condition. Um, maybe a size 36? These are like new. Passionate comfort. Very nice. Hopefully these are worth something. So they do have the ankle straps, velvety little sandals with a slight heel on them. But look at the bottoms. Like, like look at this. Like, I don't, these have never been worn. There's no way. Very nice. It's like a navy blue suede. Okay. Um, Saks Fifth Avenue. I believe these retail for a lot. I don't know if they would, I don't know how they would resell for. Um, black heels. It's almost like a reptile print. These look like they're in pretty decent condition. Um, yeah, like look at the heel. Looks great. Just a little bit of wear in the front, but not the back. I don't know. Um, there's a tag, but these look 
pretty nice. I love the shoes box. Calvin Klein heels, pointed toe. Um, oh, we have some wear back here, size seven. So right here we've got wear. Here's the inside. They look really pretty good except for that, dang it. Bottoms don't look too bad. Man. Yeah, and you can actually, dang. There's like a piece of material missing and you can see the like inside. I'll still list them, but probably for pretty cheap. Okay, last pair and one ankle strap. So it looks like the, this is for the Lulus. So that's good, but no strap for these guys. That's really sad. Like, what do you even do? I don't know, what would you guys do with these? Like, would you list them? Do I get a different strap, like different straps? I, I guess I should look up and see what these are worth. They seem like really great quality. Um, let me know what you guys think. Okay, last pair. I saw these, I was hoping they were Birkenstocks, but they're not. Um, but they're Torrid clogs. So these are called clogs. Great condition. I guess I always try to show you guys the bottoms because that, you know, really just tells like their condition. That's why I try to show the bottoms first. <laughs> I'm not seeing a size tag. Ugh, I don't see a size. Um. Actually, they fit me. So I'm thinking they're like a size nine. I don't need them. Dang it, I hate it when things fit me. <laughs> I mean, I love it, but I hate it. They seem really wide, but I actually have wide feet, so <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. Okay, um, I'll tally those up and put how many were here, but I feel like it may have been more than 15. I don't know. They have been adding in at like an extra item lately, I've been noticing. Hey, let me know what you guys think. The next video should be the handbags box. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.